Welcome to a Thursday edition of Auto News Now. I'm Kristen Strakalaitis. Let's get straight to your afternoon headlines. U.S. auto safety regulators have launched an investigation into more than 1.7 million Honda vehicles. That for unintended automatic emergency braking. The probe covers 2018 to 2019 Honda Accord midsize sedans and 2017 to 2019 Honda CRV compact crossovers. NHTSA says it has received 278 complaints of sudden braking with nothing obstructing the vehicle's path. Six of those allege a collision occurred with minor injuries. The complaints say the braking happens without warning. In a statement, Honda says it is cooperating with the investigation and is committed to safety. Turning to Tesla, the automaker may be preparing for a major expansion in China. Sources telling Reuters that the company will start work on a new plant in Shanghai as soon as next month. The effort is part of a plan to more than double production capacity in China in order to meet growing demand. Tesla currently sells China-made vehicles domestically and exports them to various markets. If the expansion goes forward, Tesla will have the ability to produce up to 2 million vehicles per year in China. Mercedes-Benz is looking to bring its Level 3 autonomous driving system to the U.S. this year. The move comes after the luxury automaker won approval for the technology in Germany last year. CEO Ola Kalinius says Mercedes has been conducting tests in the U.S. and talking with authorities. Level 3 autonomous driving means the driver can hand over control to the vehicle but must be ready to take over when prompted. Mercedes says its drive pilot technology allows drivers to take their hands off the wheel and engage in certain secondary activities such as watching movies, sending emails, or communicating with colleagues. Motional and ride services company VIA say they will launch a robo-taxi service in Las Vegas today. VIA will use vehicles outfitted with motional autonomous driving systems to offer free rides between several locations in downtown Las Vegas. Motional is a joint venture of Hyundai and supplier Aptiv. And in personnel news, Shilpan Amin has been tapped to become the next president of General Motors International. He currently serves as GM's Vice President of Purchasing and Supply Chain. Amin will replace Steve Kiefer, who is retiring. The 58-year-old Kiefer has spent four decades with the automaker. Both moves are effective April 1st. That's all for today. Have a wonderful afternoon, and we'll see you back here tomorrow.